they do have appreciation. They uh, they understand how far they've come because we when we were there at the beginning, um, there wasn't a lot of people wanting to play football, and there was a lot of work to be done. And a lot of those guys that our seniors this year were that first group I had that started as sophomores and probably weren't ready. We got our butt kicked a little bit, and then uh, they've grown and, and put the work in the off season. So they understand how far we've come, and, and there's appreciation even from last year's group come to games, and it, it's a special feeling in the locker room knowing what they've accomplished the last two years. Now we talk about back-to-back -back appearances, but you're playing a team that is here every year. I mean, you all got like Taylor, right? Mm -hmm. What do you know about him? What do you? I mean, the program almost speaks for itself if you follow football down in that area. What do you know specifically about this year's team? We know they're a perennial power and that we're the exact opposite probably that <laughs> definition, but uh, they have a, they have a good team. They have uh, a six, seven receiver and uh, they run, still run split back very, still run uh, attacking style defense, cover zero. Um, so they kind of do what they do because they got really good athletes and uh, they got a lot of tradition and we formed the kids of them today about their tradition and we need to shy away from that. We want to embrace that, that we're playing one of the probably perennial powerhouses in Virginia historically and look at where we've come, you know, how far we've come so far.